everybody, my name is Becky, wildlife interpreter here at Turpentine Creek Wildlife Refuge, and welcome to this week's Tiger Tuesday. So today we're going to talk about our animal residents in the cooler weather, and how they like the cooler weather, and maybe how some of them do a little different things in the cooler weather, and what we do to help them during the winter months. So often when you visit Turpentine Creek during the warmer months, you may see the cats hanging out in their pools, spending time in the shade, taking naps in their den, um, taking naps on the benches, things like that. The winter months do bring different things to see the cats as well. Because in the summertime, you may see them playing earlier in the mornings and later in the evenings. But in the winter months, you get to see them throughout the day. Sometimes they'll be running throughout that habitat, attacking those toys, playing in the snow, taking their famous cat naps in the sunshine, sitting up on top of a bench, watching everything going on for the day. So not all of our animals react to the winter months the same. Um, our bears, for example, they will hang out inside a little more, come outside a little less. Our rhesus macaque, Goober, he's usually found inside his building just looking out the window at visitors going by. Most of our African servals, they'll hang out right by the door, sometimes venturing further out into their habitat, but usually hanging out right by the door of their night house. So all these animals do a little bit different things during the winter time. Summertime is really warm for these cats and having that fur coat's gotta be pretty hot. So the cooler weather is a favorite for the animals. So what exactly do you, we do for the animals during the winter time to help keep them warm with our cooler temperatures, especially as it gets a little colder? So all of their night houses are very well insulated. Their dens are actually septic tanks that are created and donated for us. So those dens are well insulated, but we'll also put mulch and straw in the floor um, of those dens to make it like a, a bedding for them actually. And then we will put fire hose flaps on the door frames for them too. All of our lion's dens and all of the dens at, at our rescue ridge area for our older animals are heated. Our leopard building, our African serval buildings, and flip our white-nosed Kawada Mundi, and goober our rhesus macaque, also have different forms of warmth in their buildings too. But just like every day here at Turpentine Creek Wildlife Refuge, we never force our animals to do anything they don't want to do. So if they want to be in a den, if they want to be taking a nap, playing with their toys, hanging out in those pools in the warmer months, sitting on top of that bench, they are free to do whatever they would like to do. So if you have not been to Turpentine Creek in the cooler months, we would love to see you come out and see what winter brings for our animals. Before long, we're gonna be getting into our live Christmas tree enrichment season and Christmas presents will be coming up within this next week. So stay tuned for future video and pictures of them enjoying their Christmas presents and their winter Christmas trees. But you know, just like always, we're always thanking you for your support, you guys are our support system to help us give these animals all those lives that they deserve and need to have and help us to encourage all these rescues that we do get. So I enjoy, encourage you to visit our YouTube channel, subscribe to it, follow us on social media, visit tcwr.org for more education pieces and more information about Turpentine. And from all of animal residents here and all of the staff at Turpentine Creek Wildlife Refuge, we wish you guys a Merry Christmas.